Just a little bit. Just a little bit. For your children, Mandus, to spare them the world you have created for us all. Why is that open on its own? Let's go down. Epic elevator ride ever. <laughs> Take the elevator down so I can take stairs up. This is madness. Ha! <laughs> Singing pigs. That's I know, even right? More of a nightmare. That would be <laughs> see them pigs sitting in their cell singing. Oh my god. And the next thing you know, they I tried. Some... I tried so hard. And then it'll turn into I a Geico uphold, commercial. I promise. I will always protect them for you. My eyes are your eyes. My heart is your heart. I will rip them loose from this rotten world and set them to burn. All to save them. The Dumuflagi. Yeah, I can, I'm I'm an engineer. Don't worry, I can do this. Melo is credit to team. I am credit to team. All right, well let's go check the rods. I mean that's the that's what you always do when an engine ain't working. Check the rods. What if you have a rodless engine? You don't. It's conceivable. Tells me I'm supposed to know. And they feel <laughs> no pain. I'm the supposed to know what I'm doing. Humane. Nah. humane, Professor. That we judge the acceptable level of suffering by the human condition. Ask the beggar, Professor. Ask the orphan. Ask the whore. Ask the starving, Professor. The weak, the sick, the filthy. Ask them to define your humane. Got some switches. Let's go see if we can flip them. Flip. I only oh. But 
I gotta go down there and see what the hell they did first. Probably. Well, they won't flip back, so... Oh, that was wrong. Man, I got lucky! Final act of sabotage. The bastard has been here, too! The epicenter of his meddlings. This is where it began. This is where it will all end. I will seek the source of this obstruction, and then I will render this sabotage potent once and for all! Okay, so they block. Got a blockage in number three. Number three's got a blockage. Let's go. There, there, there's no pigs here. Compound X. Highly flammable, highly corrosive, highly toxic. Well, let's go in there. Man, for a second I thought you were making a noise just fooling me. Who? You. This oh. crap. I think I'm getting a lady. Oh, he's just I shut the fool thing. You. I think I'm becoming radioactive. Who? That was the hardest puzzle of them all. Darlings, I have almost saved you. But not yet. Set them all free. Uh-oh. What the hell did I do? I 
I live. I breathe again. I rise. I will rise to bleach the sky and still the water. I will spin the world wheel and set the future upon the path to redemption. Where are my children? You promised me my children. My time is come. More pig. More pig. Boys. Boys. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Poor pigs. Come in, no one can come in, you asleep in the yard, bad piggy, dirty pig, stinky, filthy animal you had, bad child and you stink- Man, yeah, what the- <laughs> Nail here. The knob is broken. Uh -oh. And now the emerging, kids will play. I raised my head to an uncaring sun, and I cursed this world of pain and despair. This civilization built on the ricketed bones of the unfortunate, on the greed and swell of mammon and empire. Cradling a stone egg in my jacket, I kissed my children farewell, and I crawled my way home. Sabotaging his body, his machine, or this body, his machine, until those children of his soul turn in new motion. He may awake to a new sun, a new year, a new century with hope in his heart. As I reach my hands to the exposed wires, I ask myself this. Is redemption possible for such a creature as I? And if not, then surely better to die amongst my creations than to continue to live as a monster. Well, it's raining pigs. Yeah. And the voice on the telephone was him. 
what of us? How do we connect? Surely I cannot be responsible for all I see about me. I cannot remember. I cannot remember. All I can grasp is in moments when the world split into two pieces and the innards of humanity fell. What if this torn agape to my open... What is that? My furicated heart. Okay. Hmm. Sometimes this font is a little squiggly. It's kind of thin. Well, it's warning. Steam vent access only at low pressure. I placed uh, it. That don't... Oh! It is! Confirmed! Mm-hmm! The pig's Where are they? Where are my children? Why do you ask, Mandus? You know the arms so well enough. I do, then if I knew oh, I'm in, I'm in that part now. I don't want to get to, oh, I don't want to get to the meat grinder version. Oh, you do, you do. <laughs> Automatic pressure, regular shut off. August 31st. Children really are the most wonderful, useful creatures. <laughs> <laughs> now that's the funniest line in this whole thing, no, i The unfortunates from the orphanage have proved indispensable in cleaning the larger steam pipes. <laughs> oh <Ew>. god! <laughs> okay, that's worse than what I said. It appears that matter from the slaughtering process may indeed vaporize at source drifts like dust through the air and lodges in the pipes, causing them to foul. Periodically we shut the pressure down and send one of our pixies into the pipes to scrub the reeks we constituted fat away. Armed with just a shortened broom, our little explorers venture into the dark. Child labor, ha ah, ah, ha ah, ah. Of course we can only keep pressure down for a short period. So they must be fast, where they risk being trapped and boiled by the superheated vapors when they rush back into the system. And we will be sending their comrades in afterwards to scrape free the cooling mess. The survivors tell me you can reach all manner of places within the complex through the pipes. I smile, tell them I am so proud, and then feed them to the pigs. <laughs> oh, 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 that's me. That's, that's horrible. <laughs> How can you live with yourself? Apparently by forgetting. Okay, which one of these things do I smash? Any of them? That's got a lock on it. Will it hurt them? A cleansing fire always burns, little Mandus, but it purifies and it makes anew. Did it hurt to carve out the fevered flesh? Did it hurt to cut free the gangrenous foot? Ask instead this. Can we save them? 
When did I say that? That is not me. That is not me! Not somebody. What's going on? Alright, we're gonna sneak in here. Can't use my light. There's all these little building blocks. Or not building blocks, but those. Whatchamadools. Oh my god. Oh god, it all turned into pigs! Mexico, and then you did eat worms with your spoon on the way to stay fat. The spoon was the same you gave your twins, then you used it to dig a hole in their clockwork souls, and you ate up their hearts like soup on the way to keep you fat. Yeah. Fat little mule, where will you dig next, I asked. You and your little silver spoon made from the silver spine of your children and wrapped in the hair of your dearly departed? Dear sweet Jesus, my darling Lilibet, what have I become? Freaking lunatic! <laughs> This month, 17. Likely there is another entrance I can use to escape this Noxus maelstrom of vengeance. 
I'll ignore the burning in my nostrils from the fumes of that godless compound X fuels these machines, and I will become the saboteur. I will destroy the pressure system, enabling me to enter the pipes without fear. Okay, so I got this. Another, yeah, there's more. Place is kind of, kind of falling apart. Alright, I guess I just got the ladder. Seems like a good time for climbing. about me, the thunder of machinery, the blast of boiling steam, I cannot pass without fear of scalding. I am a lobster, cracked, my circulation stagnant, my vital motions impeded. Steam will boil my fool unless I can find a way to shut it off. Okay. So yeah, I'm going in there. Ah, this one. caused by the rushing steam pressure could be catastrophic, certainly enough to force a temporary stalling of this entire engine. That should cause the steam pressure to drop. Man, this you clever old goat. I can feel this horror, this grief, this betrayal boil into fury. I will not stand, I will not be undertrodden. If this machine is my heirloom, I am the overman. I guess I just gotta pull all these. Go for it. I need to put stuff in there. I need to go get those.
Oh god. Man, I'm glad I ran. That is disgusting. Hey. Right. I'm not going I'm not going back down. Pipes and out of the engines. Now quickly through the pipes before the pressure returns and they fill with boiling corrosive steam. I sense the machine snarl itself about its unholy and human mind coil slick send its dark tendrils through its conduits to repair the damage. You can repair itself? What? Yeah. I will return to the streets. I will fetch help and I shall lead the people upon the factory, burn it to the ground and seal its evil place underground forever. Yeah, burying it's always worked out. And it's gonna be just that simple. Totally same. Not in the least. What happened to the nice music? Wonder. Pig somewhere. Like. Man. No. Oh no. Let the pigs. The 
Is that a dead body? Why did they take all their clothes? <laughs> Is that what pigs do? They kill them and then they take their clothes? Where that body looked a little lumpy. Lump. Go in there. Oh, I'm going with I just don't want to do it. Oh, you take the clothes before that you shave the head I and move it. The and here. then. I own this and the fun part I begins. This city. No! This is not what I meant! This is not what I meant at all! Too bad it's fucking what? Oh god. And then that's the worst part. But I can't open it. Did you try pulling it the other way? Yeah I did. Oh. Redeem yourself. 
burning! London's burning! So I better tell Wix. God forgive me, what if I unleashed? I stand and smell the burning city, see ash upon the wind, I hear the roars of the sickening beasts and the screams as they fall upon the city and drag its people below for slaughter. Now I begin to understand what the other composite ingredient of compound X must be. And I also understand this. It's my responsibility now. I must find a way back to the heart of the machine and complete what I started. Cyanide doesn't have this new material to work with. Oh, and it's getting late, so make sure to have a good day. Oh, okay. okay. Have a good day too, John. Yeah, it's getting close to quitting time. See you later, John. Later. Thanks for hanging out. Enjoy the piggies nightmares. Yeah, no one tells Cyanide. Never. Oh, he knows. No, it doesn't. <clears throat>
goodness to me. Hey! This is full of the sulfur monster. Being fully steers? Are you really so very different? Do you genuinely believe your work kids? Generally believe your works of evil are any greater than the rest of them? Or is simply a weak man, a product of his age, the same as any other? This is empire. Cretan this is the killing it is the natural result of this social Darwinism. If you are evil, then this world is evil. You just let the blood run in the street rather than hiding it in the poorhouse. Hold the blade and slide it home yourself. You do not pay a man to do this for you where you cannot see it. If you are evil, at least yours is an honest evil, and that alone makes you Ubermensch. Uh, and thus I wash my hands and take to bed. But <laughs> <laughs> why? Guys really do that? I guess. Huh. Well. That was interesting. Shortcut. Oh. Oh yeah. Let's see if I can do a good part then. Save the piggies for later.
shit? Streets and alleys. There are too many of these damnations, these beasts loosed on the street. To all have come from the engine rooms. As I emerged, I counted three of the damnable chromatic lifts which suggest the machine has been planning this for some time, smuggling routes to the surface all about this neighborhood. If my bearings are correct, beyond the alley I should stay directly over the ignition. And I'll wager that if I find a pneumatic there, it will, it will carry me back to the machine's heart. Well, at least I don't have to go all the way through the middle again. Yeah. yeah. Well, it's after three, so I reckon... Beast! Oh, hold on. Creature! Where are my children? Where are my children? I was just yelling. Okay. I reckon we'll pick this up tomorrow. More piggy nightmares for later. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know about some of that, but... Just the uh, stop touching things. <laughs> that's this that's is, quite enough. It's an understatement. Yeah. Okay. Well, that's where we'll end it for right now. Say goodbye, bug. What the oink? That was your goodbye, really? Mm-hmm. Um...